Measuring speed Let us conduct a small activity to measure the speed of an object. We are now going to measure the speed of a ball. Draw a straight line with the help of a chalk. Stand about 1 or 2 meters away from the line and roll the ball on the ground such that it rolls perpendicular to the line drawn. Record the time at the moment when the ball touches the line and also when it comes to rest. The distance between the point where the ball crossed the line and the point where it came to rest has to be measured. Let different people repeat the same activity and record all the measurements. Calculate the speed in each case. We can now compare the speed of various activities like walking or cycling with our friends. The speed of different animals can also be measured. It is interesting to know that the satellites launched into the Earth's orbit by rockets obtain a speed of 8 km per second while a tortoise can move only at a speed of 8 cm per second. Once we have a speed of an object, we can find the distance moved in a given time by using the formula distance is equal to speed into time. We can also find out the time that a particular object would take to cover a given distance at a certain speed. By using the formula, time taken is equal to distance by speed. One must have observed a meter fixed on vehicles to measure the speed. Such a device is known as speedometer. There is also another device called the odometer which measures the distance moved by the vehicle.